Greetings, friends. This is Alan Wolk, and welcome to another episode of Against the Wall. Today, we're going to talk about the ad-supported side of all of these new flicks and why we think that they're going to see a lot more uptake in light of the coronavirus pandemic and the economic insecurity that's going along with it than they would have prior to this. So let's take a look at this. Most of these new flicks are launching um, Peacock, HBO Max, Hulu already has it, um, Viacom CBS, whatever they're going to do with that. They're all going to have an ad-supported version and an ad-free version, and the price differential is fairly substantial. So if you're somebody who's worried about not being able to pay the rent or just not being able to pay your bills in general, the idea of paying five, something like five or six dollars for an ad-supported version versus ten or eleven dollars for an ad-free version is going to sort of be a no-brainer. Um, and we think that there are going to be a lot of people who fall into that bucket. Now you may ask, why would somebody who's afraid of not paying the rent be paying money for TV? And the answer is that that's something that we have found, the industry has found in many studies, that TV is one of the last things that people give up. It's a low-cost entertainment. And if it is just $5 a month, we think a lot of people are still going to go for it. So you have that, and what is the ultimate fallout from that is that there'll be a lot more ad-supported inventory on OTT because there'll be a lot more people watching it. Just to sort of frame it, see I made a nice little frame there. Um, Hulu now estimates that around 60% of their audience, 60 to 70% of their audience takes the ad-supported version, and we think for some of these new services in light of the economic fallout, that could go up to as much as 70 to 80% of the people taking ad-supported versus ad-free. Um, you might even see some of the other services offering an ad-supported service, not Netflix though, not Netflix. But for the other services, you will definitely see a lot more people taking the ad-supported version, which means a lot more OTT ad inventory, which means a lot more budget being shifted to said OTT ad inventory. Um, and that's going to be significant in 2021. Anyway, that's our prediction. More people taking ad-supported flicks because of economic insecurity due to the coronavirus. Hopefully, you all are staying safe, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.